So get a rack of beef ribs. I'm going to show you how to do the beef ribs in a barrel. I use a 45 gallon drum, steel drum to barbecue it in, which I'll show you in a little while. So I just use basically, once it's thawed out, I just salt and pepper the hell out of it. And then let it sit for an hour or so prior to cooking. So we'll head out in just a bit. So basically now getting ready to put it on the barbecue I just uh, took a coat hanger and I'll hook it so that it hangs down in the uh, barrel. So again it's just a coat hanger hook that I use. And obviously if you had two of them you would wrap it, bend it in a big W and hook both in and hang them in there. So basically here's my uh, steel barrel, 45 gallon steel barrel will do. And basically, uh, actually I've had this for a few years now, but basically uh, um, the only thing you do to it is, you'll see I drilled quarter inch holes, uh, four of them, just a couple inches off the bottom. Um, just to give it some air for down below, venting, not much. Because what'll happen is, is I'll end up putting uh, a lid on this thing, which I'll show you in a while. And the only thing that works that I found so far is birch, just because it's a hardwood and it tends to uh, um, create a really good coal. Because I'm going to take about an hour and a half to uh, burn it down to coals before I can actually barbecue. So we'll show that to you in a bit. Okay, so basically I got the fire going here and basically I fill the barrel right up with birch and uh, can't see too much but that'll take about an hour to burn down when you fill up a 45 gallon drum. Now in this case I'm only going to do one rack of ribs but normally I do two racks and if I do two racks of ribs I fill the um, birch right to the rim of the barrel and let it so burn down. Pretty well ready to put the... I'm just gonna level out the flames a little bit, they're the coals, and then I'm going to take this rebar, lay it across like so, and then there's my ribs, and I'm just going to, this is how it hangs up, so now she's hanging in there, and the second I uh, put this plywood on, The flame will go out and then she'll just start smoking away and you let her sit for you know check on it but basically there's nothing to do for about an hour and 40 minutes so again the key is to keep uh, have enough coals in there so it'll keep cooking away for an hour and 40 and usually uh, that's filling it up with uh, birch to the top let it burn down and I've cooked as many as four racks of ribs that's just one but I've cooked as many as four at a time so now you see it smoking that's because the flame's gone out now and uh, it'll start just sort of cooking and curing there you'll see it down in there it's the flames are out now it's just pure coals that's about it we'll see her when she's done here yum yum 